The length tool is used for measuring linear items such as cables and pipes. It can also be used for measuring walls on 2D plans. Before you begin, ensure that your scale is set correctly. To start, let's add a new length. Enter the item's description. Select your preferred line style and color. You can also choose to display the length total on the plan if needed. And add a label if necessary. Click Create. Then click to mark the starting point of the length and click for each subsequent point. Hold Shift to lock the length in 15 degree increments. If you make a mistake, hold Control or Command on a Mac and press Z to undo the last point. Double click to finish the length. If you need to add heights to lengths, use the measurement option meter squared. Our wall is 2.4 meters high and then create your length and start measuring. You can see the meters squared measurement under your stage. To remove a length, click on it and press delete on your keyboard. You can also go to actions and click delete. To edit a length, click on it and adjust any individual points. Now, to use the square mode, click Freeform and select Square. Click on one corner where you want to start your measurement. Then drag your cursor to the opposite corner and click again to finish. For measuring both straight and curved lines, there are two shortcut key options available in Freeform mode. you can create a curved section while drawing by pressing Q. Or you can transform a straight section into a curve by pressing W. For more information on the length tool, check out our help guide, which offers a comprehensive guide and tips on how to use it effectively.